Well, the Queen City Rotary Club continues its support of organizations throughout the community. And joining us live to talk about some of their upcoming events is president of the Queen City Rotary Club, Monique Ruth. Thanks so much for being here, Monique. Thanks, Sharice. Thanks for having us. Absolutely. So tell us about the Rotary Club, who you guys are, what you do in the community. So the Queen City Rotary is a group of 60 plus um, community members, mm -hmm. small business owners. We get together once a week on Thursday mornings and we come up with ideas on community service and try to give back to the community as much as we can. And we have two events that pretty much come up with most of our funds that we give back to the youth in the Manchester and surrounding areas. Mm -hmm. And we actually have one of our big events, our biggest fundraisers coming up on January 27th called the Comedy Bowl. Right. That is the weekend before the Super Bowl every year and we tie it into football. So we have a football nice. theme. It's a really, really fun evening. So we have three comedians. We have a silent auction. We have a live auction. We have different raffles and a spread of food that's incredible that our Rotarians put together. <laughs> so for $40 a ticket or we look for sponsorships, uh, last year we raised over $50,000 wow. and we put that together with the funds we raised from our event in the fall. We have a road rally, if you will. So in the spring, we take applications for grants from youth organizations mm -hmm. and we have a breakfast and we give out all that money and we helped over 40 charities last year. That's amazing. And if people want to go to the Comedy Bowl, are there still tickets available? There are. We are definitely looking for people to attend. Once you attend, you're a lifer. You will come <laughs> every year. It is a great night out. Like I said, $40 a ticket. We have sponsorships available. You can go to queencityrotary.org. All of the information is there if you're looking for a sponsorship or to buy an individual ticket. And it must mean so much to the community. I know you guys do focus a lot on youth, right, to, yes. to better the community. Tell me a little bit about that. So we help every nonprofit that we can. We take in applications. The application goes up online in about April, May. We have a breakfast and the funds go back to the youth charities wow. in and around Manchester. That's huge. It's, it must feel it's amazing great. to be a part of that to it's help out the community. It's great to have even the breakfast being there with all of the folks and giving out the money to the different charities and it, it ranges from every that we have startup charities mm -hmm. i always find out about new organizations for the youth in manchester that i didn't even know we had Wonderful. so it's a really good opportunity for us to get to know what's going on in the community as well as get back to the community well thanks so much monique for all the wonderful work you do Appreciate thank you it. thank you we'll send